the scriptures are written in context. And if you don't understand the context, then you're going to take the scriptures out of context. Verse 20, And Jacob set a pillar upon her grave, that, that is the pillar of Rachel's grave, unto this day. And so Jacob marked the spot where Rachel had passed away. He put a pillar upon her grave. And even unto that, this day, you can find Rachel's grave near Bethlehem. Verse 21. And Israel journeyed and spread his tent beyond the tower of Edar. And so he kept journeying forward. Uh, the scripture ref ref refers to him as Israel. And so that's who we are. We are Israel. We are a people. We're not a religion. We're the 12 tribes of Israel. Each tribe has a name. We're of the tribe of Judah. The tribe of Judah, or the southern kingdom of Judah, that encompasses Benjamin, were called Jews. That's who the Jews were. People think Jews is all 12 tribes of Israel. Jews is only the southern kingdom of Judah. That's who the Jews are. The rest of the tw ten tribes that were scattered were not called Jews. They were called Israel. When, they, when, when Solomon was king, Israel was divided into two nations, the, the, the northern kingdom and the southern kingdom. And the northern kingdom was called Israel with ten tribes, but the southern kingdom was called Judah with two tribes. And so the southern kingdom were called Jews, but the ten tribes of the northern kingdom were called Israel. But when they sinned, they were no longer referred to as Israel. So in Paul's writing, in the epistles, and in the book of Acts, you see reference to Jews and Greeks and all these other places, Corinth and Ephesus and Galatians and Colossians and Samaria, all these places, they're talking about the ten tribes, uncircumcised and circumcision. They're using these two monarchies to denote the two kingdoms of Israel. But if you don't study the scriptures, you don't know that Israel was divided into two kingdoms. And so when you get to the New Testament, that's why a lot of people are ignorant. They don't know that they're referring to the two kingdoms of Israel. So Israel journeyed, and he spread his tent beyond the tower of Edar. And so as he kept journeying forward, he saw this tower of Edar. And that's where he spread his tent, where he dwelt there. Verse 22.